Scene number one. Okay, script reader, give me the line. You're in an artist block. Oh no. I know, you haven't made art in like months. That sounds terrible, but I really wish there was some way to get out of it. But there is. There is? Yes, that's what the point of this video is. Okay, scene end. Before you speak. Yes. Black turtleneck. Yes. The rock wears that very often, but this is my only winter clothing. Um, yeah. Man, that joke felt better in my head. Now I just don't know where to like, take it. The rumors are true. I've been in a rut, in a block, in a dry desert of art desertness. They were telling the truth. Here's the game plan. I'm going to do art. No thinking, no judgment, no criticism from the little Miss Meanie Bully pants inside my brain. Just creating. But first, I need painting clothes. <sighs> okay, don't question this scene. This is I um, put this off until later. Scene, art. Colored pencils, stickers. Let's go. Welcome to today's meeting. Let's okay, so I've had this idea in my mind for a really long time. I want to make like 3D painting. So we have some clay here, and I'm just gonna build some things with the clay, and then we're gonna put it on this paper. I'm good. Tools. Here we are. This reminds me of my childhood. I describe my childhood at all as the age of six. That's childhood for me. When I was six years old, which I probably wasn't, but that's my childhood. Um <laughs> Y'all. Normally I just cut this out, but the amount of time that my mind was just like, it's astounding. Look at me. All right. <laughs> like what? I just, what were they talking about? Anyways, at six years old, I was really into the Grinch. I loved pink, I loved ponies, I loved fairies, but also the Grinch. And I told my parents, you know what I want for Christmas? Nothing except a seven foot tall Grinch statue. Did I get it? No. But I did also want a rake one year, like a leaf rake. I want Santa to get it together. I hope for this year. A rake. A leaf rake. Actually, I don't like raking leaves anymore. And back and forth. Oh, it's so cute. It feels like a little elephant, don't you think? What is going on? My hair. What can I do with you? What else? What else? Divine inspiration. I know. <laughs> This is always a problem. I like start off the day things with like so much energy and then after like 10 minutes I am, I'm drained. Little snakey. Anyone else have like one of those pinkies that just like boop? My pinkies are always like this. Whatever I'm doing, they're like this. We're going to make a box. But how? This reminds me of the Grinch. With the little wispies. Hello. You doing your job? Ah! This is just not right. I have to do some rearranging. Resume. Now this one is gonna look like a vase, kind of. Whoa, this is cool. It looks like Maleficent's horn. You wanna wind it in and out thing. So now let's make it connect like it's infinite. Oh yeah. I <gasps> almost lost it. And next, what do we want? We just want like a scrumple. Is that a word? Scrumple? What else? I know, I know! It came to me in a vision. Little circle circleies. And then a little BB one. Oh, it's so cute. It's like a little family of squiggly. Okay, now. <gasps> Ooh, inspiration just struck. Squishy, squishy. This one feels like an elephant. No, something else. It's like a feeling inside, but I can't quite picture it. You know what is a shame? I think my humor would be like times solid 12 if I knew about the meme world. The memes? No, I do see them, I do feel something, but I don't remember it. Like, you know people that just have so many ingrained memes? You know what I'm thinking? Brittany Borowski. She has so many memes in her mind. How? How do you remember it? Tell me! Now that we have our little yellow pizza slices, we're gonna wrap them. And now, I'm going to connect them on all the triangle sides. Like a little tulip. Let's do another orange type inspired thing. The camera just died! I had a genius idea for this, and then the camera died. What was it? Yeah. Isn't that so cute and tiny and cute? Reminds me of the slag. Sometimes I think about the slugs from Flushed Away. It makes me happy. Boop, a boop, a boop. And then smush. A boop, a boop. Roly poly. Squish. I was inspired by the clouds. I believe we were done. Let's go put these in the oven. I added the passion fruit to my shaker along with 
In Germany, they love sparkling water, and it got to me. I as well now enjoy sparkling water. It helps me keep hydrated because I feel fancy. Insert push. One more time. The like this. Doing dish speed round. Ready, set, go. I believe some of them are ready to be extracted from the oven. I probably shouldn't touch it. I need like a tweezer. I have the surgical tool. These ones are gonna stay in there for a little bit longer. Cramp, period. I'm okay. Dishes. Oh. Ten more minutes. Now on to the drawing. You know, I had in my mind the whole fantasy of painting and drawing so many things during this time. It's already been multiple hours and I am still on the first thing. That is always what it is. We shall paint with gouache because it has a nice opaque, uh, consistent looking way. Ugh, that means I need water. But before we even start painting with gouache, I have an idea and that is to just color in shapes, just things that I want to draw. Here. Onto the wash. We're gonna use a fancy water. You know what's really strange? Is that there are people that have a consistent sleep schedule. What? People have that? That's my goal. 2021. Here we come. You know what I think? No. I need to practice using gouache more. This is just not what I want. Hey, 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 stop it. You're just here to create, Anya. Oh man, we're at the final stage. Let's glue our things on here. This looks like a child's project. It felt so much better in my mind. <laughs> We're done! Here it is. In all its glory. There's one last art idea that I need to get out of me because I had it inspiration late at night. This is the most annoying thing about art inspiration when I do receive it, is it's like right before I'm about to fall asleep. Like I'm like, mm. and then it's like, then I know if I don't write it down or draw or something, I'm gonna forget it. So then I had to disturb my sleep and draw it. My thumb hurts. What it was was a human. Their neck is like not on their body. Well, it is on their body. It's just very long. And then there's the hand. They're just trying to pull the head together back to where it should be. I did not draw the arm long enough. And then they're kind of like, like lift a heavy weight because the head is a heavy weight. What is going on here? What is this? I wanted a bed. This is what it feels like to wake up in the morning. I am a fan! I like this! Am I out of my artist block? Possibly. Ah! So what's the plan here? Are you gonna say something? Do you even remember what you're doing? I'm trying to end the video? Cause you're making this very hard for me, Anya. I have to edit this. Is this still filming? I hope this maybe helped you out of your art block if you're in one. Thank you for watching. Bye.